What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Dash Reacts. And today we're going to react to another In Living Color sketch. So this is the love connection with Mike Tyson featuring Jim Carrey. Let's check it out. Hi, welcome back to Love Connection. Told you we'd be back in two and two. Our next guest says she likes her men to be very wealthy. Let's say hello to Robin Gibbons. Jim Carrey, man, a master of impressions. So I guess that's his, what, Chuck Woolery? Is that the name of the guy who did Love Connection? It's Chuck Woolery, Chuck Woolery impression. And, uh, man, it's just always nice to see, like, a young, hungry Jim Carrey doing his thing. So good. All right, Robin. Wait a Hello, Charles. Don't ever call me Charles. I'll go off. <laughs> so Robin, tell us about this wealthy thing. Chuck, I don't... Is that... Why can't I get the name? The woman who plays Sinclair from Living Single, like, in her hay? She was in that first season of In Living... Wow. I don't want people thinking that I'm the type of woman who's only interested in the size of a man's wallet. Mm-hmm. I mean, there are things that are just as important. Like what? Well, like what's in the wallet. Am I right? Thank you. Okay. Well, Robin, last time you were here, you picked a man to go out with. Now you're back to tell us how it went. Let's say hello to Mike Tyson. He's doing this. Hello, Michael. Hi, Michael. Hi, Robin. How you doing, Chuck? Hi there, Mike. How are you? Well, I gotta say, I'm really ecstatic to be here. You can tell this is an early season because that's Keenan Ivory Wayans like coming off camera to do stuff, right? Because he he was like the mastermind kind of behind the scenes, right? But when he's on camera, yeah, man, he's making it happen in, in the early, early seasons. All righty then. Robin, tell us how the date started. Well, at first I called Michael, and of course things didn't go very well because he's just a boxer from Brooklyn, and of course I was a Harvard medical student. What about you, Mike? What did you think of Robin? Oh, well, Chuck, when I first saw Robin, I was ecstatic. I mean, she had this, she had this really tight dress on, you know, the kind with the push-up bra, and the breasts were like popping right out, like hitting me right in the eye, you know? And as soon as I saw him, Chuck, I said, wow, I'm in love, you know? <laughs> Sounds like you two really hit it off. So where'd you go first? Well, first, Chuck, <laughs> we went to this lovely little jewelry store where I allowed Michael to purchase me a very lovely ruby, diamond, and sapphire collection and a matching car. Sounds nice. Yeah, Robin Givens did get that, that image. I mean... I and I don't know too much about Robin, so I can't say for sure, but yeah, like a lot of people kind of blamed her for kind of messing up, messing up Mike's, like messing up Mike's mojo a little bit, if you will. But yeah. You give Mike anything? Lithium. <laughs> it, made, it made me feel really ecstatic, Chuck. Uh -huh. Yes, we know, Michael, we know. So where'd you go next? Well, then we went to the most beautiful little wedding chapel where my mother was waiting with the justice of the peace, and we got married! Thank you very much! Mike, what did you think of Robin's mother? Well, I gotta be honest, Chuck, I wasn't too ecstatic. <laughs> you know, I looked at her mom, the first thing I thought was, wow, this lady really needs a hair weave. I'm really sorry, darling, but your mom's head, her forehead is just way too big. And she just has a little, too little hair to cover it, you know? But I tell you something, though, what really separates Robin from her mom is class. Because the Franks would still bother me because I had a boiled egg, too. And I kind of cut one in the car, you know? And her mom made a big stink out of it. <laughs> Robin, we're almost out of time. Tell us about the rest of the day. Well, Charles... After the bank, the lithium began to wear off, and Michael went a little wild. Oh, Didn't come you, on, Robin. What happened, Mike? 
Oh, well, well, Chuck, it was really simple. It was quite innocent. You know, I was in the parking lot picking up the car. I'm waiting on Robin and her mom. And I see this girl. She has a really nice butt. So I walk over. I go, hi, my name is Mike. And then I shove my tongue down her throat, you know. And this guy comes over and goes, hey, that's my mother. So I punch him in his gut, you know, and he started making little warm noises. It was pretty funny. He was like, oh, God, I'm bleeding internally. It was pretty funny, huh? And it reminded Wait, me of the Bone Crusher Smith fight where I hit him in his third rib and then tried to push his nose up in his brain, you know? <laughs> I can't remember the rib. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> bing, bing. Down. Bing. Wow, that was quite a date. <laughs> Let's see who our audience picked for you. Was it Mike? <laughs> John Kennedy Jr. Or Donald Trump. I remember that. Remember? They picked Mike by 41%. So if you two would like to go out again, <laughs> ultimately, Mike will pay for it. Well, there is a lovely little fur salon I'd like to go to. Michael, I wouldn't mind. <laughs> what about you, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> well, be sure to come back and tell us about it. Hey, Mike, maybe I'll see you on Scrabble sometime. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. Hey, ecstatic. E X K I T. All right. Are you gonna tell him he's wrong? <laughs> well, that's it, folks. I'm Chuck Woolery. Until next time, may all your dates be a matter of public record. Classic in living color sketch from back in the day. It was cool seeing three different impressions from, from three talented people. So you had Keenan Ivory Wayans, who's usually behind the camera, playing Mike Tyson. That was that was awesome. And Jim Carrey being Chuck Woolery. Fantastic, as usual. And then seeing Kim Coles as Robin Gibbons, man. Uh, also very, very funny. So it's just this, this pool of talent on that show. And that's why I like watching it. But if you enjoyed this reaction, please make sure to give this video a like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.